Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to set your CT rate on the SCM630 MCT ML, which is also known as the multi load. And there's four different part codes for this series. So that'll be the SCM630 MCT hyphen 1L, hyphen MID, the hyphen 2L, 3L, and 4L. So the only bit that changes is the 1L, 2L, 3L, 4L and that represents how many loads you can actually monitor per meter. So in this video, we're gonna show you how to change or set your CT ratio on this meter. So we've got the meter powered up here using the auxiliary supply, live and neutral, and we're gonna show you how to set the CT ratio. This is the 1L, um, but this is gonna work for any of the ML series, which includes the STM630 MCT iPhone one l iPhone MID, or the 2L, the 3L, or the 4L. So this will work for all of them. So we've got the meter powered up, we're gonna press and hold E. Run to the, set in, uh, the password, sorry. We're gonna press the upwards arrow, which is MD, to change that to 1000, and press and hold E again. Then we're gonna get into the settings menu, and we're gonna tap P to get down to CT. Keep tapping, okay, we get CT2, let's just tap it one more and we get ct1 ct2 we don't want to mess with because it's always going to be 100 milliamp for these meters ct1 we're going to press and hold e and now we get to choose channel whether it's channel one channel two channel three that refers to the loads that you're monitoring because obviously with these ml meters you can monitor up to four loads with a single meter this is a 1l which means we're only monitoring one load anyway so it's just going to be channel one you can change it going up and down here but there's only, there's only one channel on this meter anyway. So um, we'll press and hold E to lock in channel one. And then we've got the option how to set the meter. It's currently set 100 amps as default. Say we wanna change it to 200 amp. So what I did was, sorry, I need to explain that. The E button allows you to, if you just tap it, allows you to go to the next digit. You can see the digits that's flashing. If I tap it, it will go through to the next one. And then the up and down arrow, so either MD or P, will allow you to change the digits up and down. I've got 200 there, so now I'm just gonna press and hold E. You can see that says good. So that's now set at 200 amp to 100 milliamp. So thank you very much for watching our video. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments or get in touch on 01268 773 422. Or you can also get in touch with us via email inquiry at smartprocess.co.uk. Uh, please like and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you very much.